Let's get started. A new day has come. We met with my best friend Mikey and decided to go to the mine to dig up a lot of useful resources. Hey, Mikey, what do you think? Are we going to find diamonds today? Of course. If we went to the mine, then we have to find the diamonds. I'm not going home without diamonds. I've been dreaming of crafting a new diamond sword and a diamond pickaxe for so long. I have to fulfill this dream. I like your plan, Mikey. Hmm, JJ, I think we found something. Look, there's some kind of secret room here. But how is this possible? I've never seen such places in the mines. Oh, you're right, Mikey. This is really a very strange place. Maybe it's a dungeon? But then, why aren't there any monsters here? Let's see what's in this chest. JJ, what did you find? Tell me soon, were there treasures in this chest? Oh no, Mikey, there was a strange potion in this chest. Hmm, what if this potion turns us into superheroes? Let's drink this potion right now! I'm sure it was hidden here for a reason. Okay, but we need the support of our viewers. Guys, please like this video and subscribe to the channel. Then Mikey and I will drink this potion and find out what effect it has. Your support is very important to us. Thanks. Well, Mikey, are you ready? The unknown awaits us. I'm always ready. Let's go. Ah, Mikey. Oh, no. Why did you become a child? Forgive me. We didn't need to drink this potion. JJ, you've become a child, too. We both became children. I can't believe my eyes. But how is this possible? Is it really all because of this potion? Oh, Mikey, we urgently need to go outside and get some fresh air. I'm getting sick. Let's go outside soon. Okay, hurry up and run. Well, JJ, are you feeling better? What's the plan? What are we going to do next? Oh, Mikey, I don't know. We are too small and defenseless. Now this world is too dangerous for us. Hey, why do small children walk without their parents? This is very bad. Kids, where are your parents? Unfortunately, I have to take you to the police station. JJ, let's get out of here. Otherwise, this policeman will stop us and we will remain children forever. Hey! We haven't been kids for a long time. There's no need to follow us. Hush! JJ, we are very small and inconspicuous. I am sure that this policeman will not find us and will pass by. Oh, Mikey, it seems you're right. It was really very dangerous, but I liked it. We were running away from the policeman like real criminals. Being kids is a lot of fun. JJ, look, this is a village cafe. I'm so hungry. Maybe we should go in and eat. Oh, Mikey, I'm very hungry too. Do you have any money? No one will feed us for free. We need money to buy food. Oh, it's very sad. I only have one dollar. Can we buy something for one dollar? <laughs> Poor naive Mikey. We can't buy anything for one dollar. We can only look at how other people eat. Oh, it's very sad. Are we really going to go without dinner tonight? JJ, I'm tired of being a kid. Let's run. We need to come up with a plan to fix everything. OK, Mikey, let's run. I am sure that we will be able to fix everything and become adults again. <coughs> JJ, I think it's time to admit it. We are losers. We failed to fix everything, and now we will remain children. This is terrible. Oh, yes, Mikey. Now we are small and helpless children, and we also have to live on the streets. The next day. Hey, baby, wake up soon. Oh, how sweet you are. Why do you live on the street? Is your brother lying next to you? Oh, it's a very long story. Mikey, wake up soon. It seems that someone has come to our rescue. Poor kids, you are very dirty. Come with me. I'll take you to my house. If you want, I can become your parent and adopt you. Mikey, did you hear that? Finally, we won't have to sleep outside. This was the most terrible night of my life. What are you standing for? Come with me. I must feed you soon. You look very hungry. JJ, but what about our plan? Do you really want to stay a child? Mikey, I just want to eat and get some sleep. Let's talk about it later. Well, here we are. You can feel at home. There is a lot of food in the fridge, and there are two bedrooms on the second floor. You can do anything here. I really hope that you will like everything. Welcome. Wow, JJ! And this house is so big and cool. Look at how many cool toys there are here. I didn't have such cool toys when I was a kid. Guys, I'm going to the store to buy you a game console and groceries for dinner. By the way, we're going to have pizza for dinner tonight. Don't miss me. I'll be back soon. Mikey, did you hear that? A game console and pizza for dinner are waiting for us. 
This is the life I dreamed of. Mikey, it's incredible. Maybe we'll stay here to live. I love being the son of a TV woman. Oh yes, I agree. TV woman is really a very caring mom. Guys, write in the comments. Do you want us to remain the children of TV woman? Let's get started. Right now, my best friend Mikey and I are going on an adventure. We are in a very scary mine, and we hope that we can find treasures here. Mikey, are you even sure that we can find anything useful here? This place is very creepy. It seems to me that it is dangerous to be here. JJ, don't worry. I'm sure there's no one here. Look, we found the chest. I told you that there are definitely treasures here. We have finally found these treasures. I'm so glad. We need to pick up all the useful items and return to the camp. Okay, Mikey. You were right. We found a chest, and there are really useful items inside this chest. Our friends will be very happy when they find out that we did not waste so much time searching for treasures in vain. Of course. Everyone will be very happy. JJ, what if there are more treasure chests here? Maybe we should stay and take a closer look at this cave. How do you like this idea? Are you sure we need to do this? Oh, yes. I want to find more diamonds. I want to craft new diamond tools. Oh, no, Mikey. This is a very bad idea. There's a wild bear here. I think this bear wants to attack us. What should we do? I told you that we need to bring weapons with us. Hurry up, Mikey. Let's run away. JJ, I can't believe my eyes. Where does a wild bear come from in this cave? Is this really his lair? We won't be able to escape from this bear. This bear is too fast. Mikey, quickly press the lever. This will help us. JJ, it's incredible. We were able to escape from the wild bear. We survived. Oh, yes, Mikey. It was an incredible adventure. Guys, please help us. Like this video and subscribe to the channel in five seconds. This will help Mikey and me a lot. Then our adventures will be even more fun and interesting. Thanks. Well, JJ, I think now is the time to go back to camp. I'm sure our girls have already missed us. Yes, Mikey, it's time to go home. Guys, we're back. JJ and I were able to escape from a wild bear. And we also found a huge mountain of useful items. It was an incredible adventure. What? A wild bear? Were you attacked by a wild bear? Guys, tell us about it in more detail. How did you manage to escape from there? Oh, it's a very long story. We can tell you this story around the campfire tonight. The most important thing is that we survived and brought useful resources to the camp. Hmm, okay. Then we'll go about our business. We will wait for the evening to hear this interesting story. Good! Let's meet tonight and discuss it! JJ, when are we going to have a new adventure? I loved it so much. I love adventures! Oh, Mikey, we have a lot of work to do in our camp. First, you need to sort out all the resources found. Do you want to help me? JJ, I saw that you found some kind of potion. Can I keep this potion for myself? I want to find out what kind of potion it is. What if I can become a superhero? Of course I don't mind, but I don't advise you to drink this potion. What if it's poison? Be careful! Okay, JJ. I promise you that I will be careful. Good luck sorting your resources. Bye! Bye, Mikey. Oh, it seems like I'm going to have to spend a lot of time and effort sorting through all the resources I've found. But it's okay. I can handle it. So, I'm very interested to find out what kind of strange potion JJ and I found in this scary cave. But how do I do it? Hmm. I'm just using this potion. I hope that I will really become a superhero. Hey, what happened? This potion doesn't work. Hi, I'm Mikey's little turtle. Where are my parents? Oh, to be honest, I'm already a little tired. I need a snack. Stop, what is it? I don't understand. Is this really the crying of a child? Why is this sound coming from my friend Mikey's house? JJ, where does a child come from on our island? We need urgent help. TV woman, I don't know anything either. Let's find this child and help him. Of course, we have to save this child. Maybe this is another prank. I have never seen children on this island. Stop, I can't believe my eyes. Is this our friend Mikey? Why did he become a child? It's really Mikey, but why did he become a child? It's incredible. Hi, are you my parents? Yes, you are my mom and dad. Dad and mom. What? Mikey, what are you talking about? <coughs> then we went into Mikey's house and saw this. TV woman was shocked. Mikey became a little kid and we don't understand how it happened. That's such a funny story. This is a very amazing story. We need to fix everything. 
How can we help Mikey become normal again? Guys, hush! Little Mikey just fell asleep. We can't wake him up. Otherwise, little Mikey will cry loudly again. TV woman, we need to put Mikey to bed. Can you do it? Oh, of course. That's good advice. I'll think of something now. TV woman, be careful. We have a small cot for children somewhere in the camp. Don't worry, JJ, she can handle it. Okay, guys, please help us. Like this video and subscribe to the channel in five seconds. This will really help us understand what's going on and help our friend Mikey. Thank you. I really hope that we can help Mikey. JJ, you said that Mikey called you from TV Woman his parents. It's true? Did he say that you are his mom and dad? Yes, it's very strange, but it's true. He called us his parents. Stop! Why is the door to my house open? TV Woman decided to put Mikey to sleep in my house. We need to check it out. Okay, JJ, we'll be waiting for you here. I can't live in the same house with little Mikey. He cries all the time. Hey, TV Woman, are you here? What's going on? I didn't agree to Mikey sleeping in my house. I won't be able to get enough sleep. Get used to it, JJ. Little Mikey needs care. You can't leave him alone. And what do you suggest? Become a father? This is my best friend. I can't. You and I are going to be his parents together until we can get him back to normal. Is it okay? We have to help him. Hmm. Are you and I going to be parents? It sounds very strange, but interesting. Okay, I agree. Let's get started. A new day has come, which means that our survival on a desert island continues. Right now, we are gathered with all our friends to have breakfast. Mikey promised to surprise us with breakfast today. Oh, yes. I hope Mikey makes his signature omelet today. I really love scrambled eggs for breakfast. Guys, I am glad to inform you that breakfast is ready. We're going to have a leftover casserole for breakfast today. I tried very hard, and I hope that you will like it. You can start eating. What? Mikey, what kind of leftover casserole is this? Is this some kind of joke? Where is the proper food? Oh, Mikey, forgive me, but I won't eat it. I'd rather wait for a normal meal. Guys, I don't want to upset you, but we don't have any proper food. There are six people living in our camp now. Our supplies are constantly in short supply. We need to get used to eating leftovers and algae. What? We don't have any proper food anymore. How are we going to survive? Food is the most important thing for us. Without food, we won't have the strength. So guys, don't panic, everything will be fine. We will find new food and eat normally. Don't worry, by the way, girls, you can help us find food. Great, camera woman and I will go in search of mushrooms and berries. I'll meet you at the camp tonight, bye. That's great, the speaker woman and camera woman have already gone in search of food. Mikey, we also need to figure out how we're going to get food. Do you have any ideas? Yes, I have a great idea. I know what we're going to do today, but first I need to find something in my chest. Oh, I really hope that I haven't lost this valuable item. Mikey, you really intrigued me. Tell me what we're going to do soon. I am very interested to find out. JJ, we're going fishing right now. Our task is to catch as many fish as possible. I am sure that we will succeed. You and I are great fishermen. Guys, I really like your fishing idea. Do you have a third fishing rod? I would really like to go with you. Oh, TV woman, unfortunately we don't have a third fishing rod, but you can come with us for company. I'm sure the three of us will have a lot more fun. Well guys, is everyone ready for our fishing trip? Today we will catch a huge pile of fish. Guys, I'm sure there are a lot of fish in this pond. Our friends will be very happy because today we will bring a lot of food to the camp. Mikey, are you sure about this? I don't see any fish here. Maybe we'd better go fishing in the ocean. We'll definitely catch something there. JJ, trust me. I am sure that we have come to the right place for fishing. TV woman, do you believe in us? Do you believe that we will catch a lot of fish today? Oh, guys, of course I believe in you. But I'm also sure that you can use the support of our subscribers. TV woman is right. Guys, please help us like this video and subscribe to the channel in five seconds. It will really help us catch a lot of fish. Your support is very important to us. Thanks. Well, JJ, stop standing still. We have very little time. Let's start fishing. Okay, Mikey, let's do it. Today, we have a very important task. We have to get food for the residents of our camp. Guys, I believe in you. You will succeed. TV woman, thanks for the support. <laughs> Mikey, I have some very bad news for you. We haven't caught a single fish all day. What should we do now? We can't go back to camp without food. 
JJ, I can't believe my eyes. How is that? We are losers. You were right. I should have gone fishing somewhere else. And now, we have to go back to the camp. Getting food at night is very dangerous. Mikey, you're right. We better start getting food tomorrow. It's okay. Guys, wait. We didn't just come here. Give me some time. I want to swim a little. It is unknown when we will return to this beautiful place next time. Join us. Stop being sad. Oh, okay, TV woman. We'll wait for you. But I'm sorry. We don't really want to swim. Personally, I'm in a very bad mood. JJ, I think I know how we can cheer up. Let's have a cool prank on the TV woman. I'm sure it will be very funny. Hmm. Okay, Mikey. Tell me what you've come up with. JJ, just watch and enjoy. It's going to be very funny now. Hmm. Okay. It's very interesting what kind of prank you're going to do. JJ, are you ready? About 3.2.1. Let's go. Aha. Uh -huh. Look. It seems we have a great catch today. Mikey, what have you done? Did you seriously steal a swimsuit from a TV woman? I can't believe my eyes. It's incredible. But you're right. It's very funny. And now, JJ, we need to get out of here right now. Otherwise, TV Woman will definitely destroy us. Guys, where did you run to? Where's my swimsuit? Let's get started. Evening came, and we gathered with all the residents of our small camp in order to discuss the further plan of our actions. We have been working hard all day and getting resources in order to escape from this uninhabited island. Mikey is building a raft, and we hope that we will be able to return home to our village soon. Oh, I miss my home so much. I really want to go back to the village. Guys, I have great news for you. I congratulate you. I've just finished building our raft. Tomorrow we can test this raft and finally try to sail home. Cool, isn't that right? What? Seriously? Mikey, were you able to finish the raft so quickly? It's incredible. I'm so glad. Girls, let's go take a look at this raft. Mikey, you did a great job. I can't believe my eyes. Are we really going to be able to finally sail off this island tomorrow? It really sounds incredible. It was easy because you provided me with all the resources. Tomorrow will be a very difficult day. We all need to get a good night's sleep and gain strength. That's why I suggest everyone go to bed right now, okay? Girls, did you hear Mikey? We all need to get some sleep, so stop standing here. Let's go to bed. I want to leave this island as soon as possible and return home. Good night, girls. Soon our torment will end and we will return home. Mikey, to be honest, I'm shocked. First of all, you've really finally finished building the raft. And secondly, I do not believe that we will return home soon. I understand you, JJ. You should get some sleep too. Good night. Good night, Mikey. Oh, how glad I am. How long have we been living on this island? A month? Two months? I can't believe that soon we will return to our home in our native village. Please, like this video and subscribe to the channel in five seconds. It will help us a lot to escape from this island and return home. Your support is very important to us. Thanks. So what? Mikey said we all need to get some sleep. Good night. Three hours later. Stop! What? I heard a woman screaming. What's going on? We need to check this urgently. Hey, is anyone here? I don't think I see anyone. Oh no, this can't be happening. There is a fire in our camp. Our raft is on fire. What should I do? Hey, who is this? TV woman, what is she doing here and why is she running away? Okay, we'll find out later. Now we need to put out the fire. Hey, wake up everyone. We have a huge problem. There's a fire in the camp. Our raft is on fire. We need to put it out. JJ, get the fire extinguisher quickly. If our raft burns down, we will never be able to escape from this island. We need to save our raft. Guys, can anyone explain what's going on here? Why is our raft on fire? What happened? Is our whole plan being canceled? Tell us. Can't we go home now? Mikey, JJ, say something at least. Guys, quiet. No need to panic. Now we'll tell you everything. Mikey, what's with the raft? What do you think? Can we restore it? No, JJ. The raft is beyond repair. I also want to know what happened. You woke us all up. I think it's time to tell you everything. Okay. Mikey, I wanted to tell you this in private. The fact is that last night I was woken up by a woman's screams. I went outside and saw a burning raft. And then I saw a TV woman running from there. I'm not sure if she's to blame for this fire, but I saw her at the scene. 
I don't think it's necessary to tell the rest of the girls. Do you understand me? I understand you. But TV Woman is the only suspect right now. We need to talk to her. Hey, TV Woman, open the door quickly. It's us, Mikey and JJ. We know what you've done. Mikey, what are you going to do? Stop. What? JJ, there's no one here. The TV Woman's house is empty. Where could she have gone? You do realize that her escape from the camp only proves her guilt in the fire? Mikey, where are you going? I'm going to look for a TV woman. Don't stop me, JJ. She destroyed all my efforts. I will never forgive her for this. <coughs> oh, it's morning, and Mikey still hasn't returned to camp. TV woman hasn't returned either. Hmm, maybe the speaker woman and camera woman saw someone. Hey, speaker woman, hi. Have you seen Mikey or TV Woman by any chance? What? I wanted to ask you the same thing. Where have they gone? What is going on in our camp anyway? Don't worry, Speaker Woman. An investigation is underway. We'll tell you everything soon. Hey, Camera Woman. Hi. Have you by any chance seen TV Woman or Mikey? No, I didn't see anyone. I don't talk to anyone all day and try to forget about what happened last night. Okay, thanks for the reply. Don't worry, we'll fix it soon. So what? I think it's time for me to go in search of Mikey and TV Woman. Oh, I've been looking for my friend Mikey and TV Woman for hours. Guys, please support me. Like this video and subscribe to the channel in five seconds. It will really help me to finally find my friends. Your support is very important to me. Thanks. So what? Now let's keep looking. Stop. What is that scream? We need to check this urgently. That scream was very close. What? Oh no, I can't believe my eyes. What's going on here? Mikey, explain it to me quickly. Why is the TV woman tied? Why did you take her hostage? This is terrible. JJ, I'm just asking her to answer my questions. I want to know why she set fire to our raft, but she doesn't say anything. Mikey, enough. This is wrong behavior. Let me ask TV Woman about it. So, TV Woman, I saw you. I saw you running from the fire. Tell us the truth. What were you doing there? Did you set fire to our raft? Okay, okay, I'll tell you everything. Yes, JJ is right. I was there, and yes, I set fire to our raft. But I didn't do it on purpose. The fact is that I couldn't sleep for a long time that night, and I wanted to go and sit by the raft. I looked at him and imagined that soon we would all return home. And then my torch fell right on the raft and the raft caught fire. I tried to put it out, but I couldn't do anything. And then I just ran away. I was very ashamed. Forgive me. Don't worry, TV woman. You didn't do it on purpose. We'll make a new raft and everything will be fine. Now, let's get back to camp. Oh, it was a very hard day. It's finally coming to an end. JJ. Do you really think that you and I will find something useful today? We haven't found anything useful in our expeditions for a long time. Mikey, I feel like today is going to be a very special day. I'm sure we'll find something very interesting today. Let's run. Oh, I really hope you're right. Our camp needs resources. The girls are worried about our situation. Mikey, do you see this? It's a mine. There are always a lot of useful resources hidden in the mines. Let's go to this mine and take a look at it. JJ, isn't it dangerous? We didn't bring any equipment to go to the mine. Maybe we should go back to the camp for equipment and then go to this mine. Oh no, Mikey. We don't have time to wait. The girls are waiting for us to return to the camp with useful resources. We can't let them down. We have to cope with our task. Do you understand that? JJ, it's very scary in this mine. To be honest, this place scares me a lot. Let's come back here another time. Oh, okay, Mikey. I agree with you. Let's get back here with our mining gear. Oh no, JJ, those rocks almost fell right on top of us. This is terrible. We are very lucky. One more second and we would have been destroyed. Mikey, I agree that we're lucky, but how do we get out of here now? We need the support of our subscribers. Precisely. Mikey, you're right. Guys, please support us. Like this video and subscribe to the channel in five seconds. This will really help Mikey and me figure out how to get out of this mine. Thanks. Okay, the audience supported us, but what should we do next? There must be another way out of this mine. We just need to find another way out. Let's do it. Oh no, JJ. We are at an impasse. Unfortunately, this was the only way out of the mine. Three hours later. Mikey, it's time for us to admit it. We are stuck here forever. 
we won't be able to get out of this mine. And we also have very little food and water left to survive. It seems that this is the end of our lives. JJ, no, don't say that. The next day. Yes, TV woman. It seems that this loud sound was coming from right here. I'm sure we're going in the right direction. Okay, let's take a close look at this place. Stop, what? JJ, Mikey, I can't believe my eyes. Have we found them? Girls, come on, we need to help them. JJ, Mikey, we finally found you. Wake up soon. Everything will be fine. Your torment is over. What? Girls, what are you doing here? I knew you wouldn't leave us in the lurch. I knew you would come for us. Hooray! Hey, why hasn't JJ woken up yet? This is very strange. Mikey, I have some very bad news. It seems JJ didn't wait for us. We probably didn't have time to save him. This is terrible. No, don't say that. JJ is my best friend. We have to help him. We have to save him. Come on, let's run. Mikey, believe me, we are also very sad, but we can no longer help him. No, I don't believe it. It's impossible. You're lying to me. I'm going to save JJ. Oh, girls, this is very sad. I'm going to cry now. <coughs> JJ was a great captain of our team, as well as our good friend. It's a pity that everything happened that way. JJ has been my best friend since I was a kid. I don't believe we'll all go home without him. It's terrible. I'm sorry, JJ, for not saving you. I will always remember you. You will always be my best friend. Guys, we can't hold back the tears. We need to get back to the camp. We will always remember JJ. Mikey, don't blame yourself for this. It's not your fault. It's just a bad set of circumstances. No one is to blame for this. Stop! What happened? Where am I? Where is my best friend Mikey? Why am I not in the mine? Okay, we need to try to get out of here. Hmm, what kind of place is this? Is this my grave? What's going on here anyway? I need to figure this out. Guys, I need your support to figure this out. Please, like this video and subscribe to the channel in five seconds. It will help me a lot to find my friends and find out from them what happened. Thanks. So what? I think now is the time to go back to camp and find my friends. Hey, guys, where are you? I'm back at the camp. Can someone explain to me what happened and why I was buried underground? Guys, I'm here. Tell me what happened. I want to know why I was buried alive. What? JJ? I can't believe my eyes. Oh, no. It seems JJ has become a zombie. It's incredible. Hey, why did Mikey faint? What's going on? JJ, the thing is, we thought you didn't survive. We came to the rescue and found you with Mikey, but you didn't show any signs of life. Are you all right? Guys, of course I'm fine. I was just sleeping very soundly. JJ, we are so glad. Girls, I'm sure we need to get back at JJ and Mikey for all their pranks on us. If we don't do this, they will never stop making fun of us. Okay, but how can we get back at them? TV woman, do you have an idea? Yes. Oh, good morning. A new day has finally arrived. Stop. Who's knocking on my door? I wasn't expecting guests this early in the morning. Now I will find out who came to me. But before that, I want to ask you for help. Guys, please support me. Like this video and subscribe to the channel in five seconds. It will help us a lot. Your support is very important. Thank you. So what? Now let's see who came to me. Hi, JJ. Good morning. We have good news for you. Do you want to know what the news is? Good morning, girls. Oh, of course. I want to find out. Do you remember the girls and I recently had a women's party? We thought it was unfair and decided to have our party together with you and Mikey. Cool. Isn't that right? Our things are already packed. It remains to wake Mikey up and go to a very cool place together. Wow! TV woman! This is great news. I am very glad. We're finally going to have some fun together. That's cool. Did someone say a party? Guys, I love parties. Hurry up and run to your secret place. I want to eat delicious food, dance, and listen to music. It's finally going to happen. Oh, yes, Mikey. I agree with you. Boys, we are very glad that you liked our idea. Get ready. 
The road will be very long, but it's worth it. Girls, we are always ready. Hurry up and run. This is going to be the coolest party of my life. Oh yeah, JJ, you're right. TV woman, what's the plan? Where are we going? Don't worry, girls. I've thought of everything. We'll take JJ and Mikey to the other side of the island, steal their clothes, and leave them alone. TV woman, this is a great idea. This will be our best prank ever. Cool. JJ, I'm so glad the girls decided to invite us to the party. I was very sad when they threw a party just for girls. Yes, I'm very glad too. I'm interested to know where the girls are taking us. What is this secret place and why is it so close? Moments later. Wow, JJ, look, do you see this? The girls have already prepared everything. It's incredible. This is a very cool place. There are very beautiful views. Oh, yes, Mikey, I agree with you. Girls, thank you very much for such a surprise. This place is amazing. Now it's clear why we ran here all day. It was really worth it. Oh, boys, don't thank us. It's all right. By the way, together with the girls, we came up with interesting games with prizes so that we would not be bored here. Do you want to compete with Mikey for a bit? Wow! Competitions? I love competitions. What do we need to do? Mikey and I agree. So the first competition is very simple. Whoever can hold out underwater longer will win. The winner will receive a pizza and a secret gift. Guys, please help me. Like this video and subscribe to the channel in five seconds. I really want to win and your support will help me do it. I have to get a secret gift. Thanks! Well, Mikey, are you ready to start our competition? I really hope that you understand who will be the winner. Yes, I will be the winner. Oh no, JJ, you'll never beat me. I'm a turtle. Water is my element. Unlike you, I can even live underwater. I will be the winner of this competition. Well, boys, I see that you are ready to start, okay? Then you can dive into the water right now. The girls and I will be watching you closely. Be careful. Good luck to you. Thank you, girls. Don't worry. I will win the loser Mikey very easily. JJ, you don't understand what a mistake you're making. You're going to compete underwater with a turtle. This is going to be a very difficult test for you. Mikey, don't you think it's time for us to end this competition with a draw? We've been standing underwater for hours. Hmm, it seems you're right. Let's finish this right now. I agree to a draw. Great, then I suggest we pop up at the same time. We will tell the girls that we have decided to end the competition with a draw and their gift will be ours together. This is a great idea. Hey, girls, we decided to end the competition with a draw. Stop, Mikey, and where did the girls go? Where is our cozy picnic? I don't understand anything. Do you see anyone? Where are my clothes? Oh no, JJ, I don't see anyone. What happened? Maybe the girls got tired of waiting for us and went home? Oh no, Mikey, I've got it all figured out. The girls brought us here on purpose, forced us to dive into the water, stole our clothes, and ran away. This was their secret plan. Oh no, how do we get back to the camp? Hey, Mikey, what's going on? Where are you taking me? I want to know that. Tell me what we're doing. JJ, hush. Something terrible is happening in our camp. I'm sure one of the girls is stealing our resources. I have been keeping records of our resources for a long time, and I realized that some resources were missing. What? Mikey, this can't be happening. TV woman, camera woman, and speaker woman are our friends. I'm sure none of them are stealing our resources. Maybe you just imagined it? I don't believe it. JJ, look, do you see this? TV woman has been around resources too often lately. I think she's stealing our resources. Trust me, I know what I'm talking about. I'm very sad to admit it too, but it's true. Oh, Mikey, this is terrible. It's impossible. But you are my best friend and I will believe you. What's the plan? What are we going to do next? Do you have an idea? We can't kick the TV woman out of the camp. First of all, we need the support of our viewers. Oh, you're right. Guys, please like this video and subscribe to the channel. Your support is very important to us. With your help, we will be able to conduct our own investigation and find out who is stealing resources in our camp. Thank you. So Mikey, let's get back to our plan. What are we going to do next? How do we make sure that it is TV woman who steals our resources? Don't worry, JJ, I have an idea. But is it just me, or is someone watching us? What? Oh no! Hello boys, what are you doing here? Is it just me, or are you following us with the girls? Has something happened? 
Why are you hiding? Oh no, speaker woman. It's not what you think. It's all right. It's just that Mikey and I really like watching you work at our camp. We are very pleased that you are helping us so much. JJ, no need to thank you. The girls and I are very happy to help you. You also do a lot for all of us. Together we are a team, and this is the only way we can survive and escape from this island. By the way, we have some good news. What? Good news? Which ones? Not far from our camp, we found a field with a lot of different plants. There may be berries and a good harvest. We want to go there right now. Do you and Mikey mind? Oh, of course we don't mind. It's all right. You can go and inspect this field. My friend Mikey and I will be happy to stay and guard our camp. Don't worry. We'll find something to do. Okay. Bye, boys. Don't miss us. We'll be back at the camp in a few hours. Good luck to you. Bye, girls. Have a good search. We hope that you will be able to find a lot of food. Phew. No one seems to have realized that we were spying on them. Mikey, I think we need to be more careful. So what? Let's do useful things. JJ, I have a much better idea. The girls left the camp for a few hours. This is the best time to verify my words. We need to inspect the TV woman's house. I am sure that we will find the stolen resources at her house. Mikey, the door to the TV woman's house is locked. It's not a problem. TV woman keeps the key to her door under a pot of flowers. We can easily go to her house and look around there. Mikey, don't you think it's a little weird? We are now stealing someone else's key and entering someone else's house. This is a crime. I don't want to be a criminal. JJ, we are not criminals. We're not going to steal anything. We're trying to find the culprit. There is nothing strange or bad about it. And anyway, what kind of crime can there be on a desert island? Hmm, okay. You're probably right, but we didn't find any evidence in the TV woman's house. Stolen resources are not hidden here. This means that TV woman does not steal anything from us. JJ, we have too little evidence that the TV woman is innocent. We need to continue our investigation. But what are we going to do? Hmm, I think I have a very cool idea. JJ, I need your help. Five minutes later. Mikey, I can't believe my eyes. We hid under the TV woman's bed. Are you sure this is a good idea? Why are we doing this? JJ, we need to make sure that TV Woman is not stealing our resources. Oh, guys, please support us. Like this video and subscribe to the channel in five seconds. Your support will greatly help us to investigate to the end and find out who is stealing our resources. JJ, hush. It seems the girls have returned to the camp. We need to be quiet and careful. Oh, home, sweet home. How I miss my sweet home. Wait, is it just me or is there something wrong here? Maybe someone came to my house. We need to look around carefully. Mikey, this is the end. TV woman will find us. No, JJ, don't move. Everything will be fine. Hmm, I must have imagined it. My house is as cute and cozy as ever. So what? After such a long expedition, I need to have a good rest. I really want to lie on my bed. Mikey, what should we do now? You've trapped us. We can't get out of here now. I don't want to live under a TV woman's bed all my life. <coughs> Mikey, come on. There is no one in the house. TV woman left the house an hour ago. We can get out of here right now. Are you ready? No, JJ, I'm sure the girls are outside right now. They will 100% see how we leave the TV woman's house. There will be a lot of questions for us. Bye, TV woman. Good night to you. Sweet dreams to you, TV woman. Good night, girls. See you tomorrow. Bye. Oh, no. Mikey, what should we do? It seems the TV woman is going to bed. I don't want to spend the whole night under the bed. We need to come up with something. JJ, don't worry. We'll wait until TV woman falls asleep and get out of here. Everything will be fine. I am sure that the TV woman will fall asleep very soon. Mikey, what was that? Did you fart? TV woman will notice us now. Oh, no. What? I see something under my bed. Oh, no. Mikey, JJ, what are you doing here? Why are you hiding under my bed? Are you spying on me? Let's get started. A new day has come, and my friends and I decided to have breakfast. Oh, TV woman, thank you so much for making such a delicious breakfast for us. When did you manage to do this? Oh, yes. You're right, JJ. It's really delicious. Thank you, TV woman. Guys, I am very glad that you enjoyed my breakfast. I tried especially for you. By the way, has anyone seen the camera woman? Is she really going to miss our breakfast? Hey, hi guys, TV woman. Don't worry, I'm here. 
but we have much more important things to do than breakfast. Guys, not far from our camp, I found a place where there are a lot of useful things. We should go there with you and bring something to our camp. Wow, useful stuff? We need useful things in the camp. Of course, let's go to this cool place. Yes, I agree with Mikey. JJ, what do you think? Hmm, I think that's a great idea. Guys, please, support us. Like this video and subscribe to the channel in five seconds. Your support will help us a lot, really. Great, thank you. So what, camera woman? Take us to this place. I really hope that we will really find something useful there for our camp. Oh, JJ, don't worry. We will 100% find something useful there. Soon you will see everything with your own eyes. You will love it very much. Guys, we're almost there. We need to be careful. I forgot to tell you that there is fire everywhere. Oh, yes, there is also a huge airplane wing here. Wow! Camera woman was right! Look at how many different things there are here. It seems all these things fell out of the plane that crashed. But why is there only an airplane wing here? Girls, Mikey and I have been to this place before, but these things weren't here before. There were only boxes here. This is very strange. JJ, let's talk about it later. Look around you. There are really a lot of things here. We need to look around and find something useful. Yes, I agree with TV Woman. There are really a lot of cool things here. Let's split up and take a good look at everything. JJ, follow me. Hmm, okay, Mikey. Let's try to find something useful here. So far, I only see different beds and curbstones, but we don't need beds and curbstones. We need something useful. JJ, do you really not want to take some soft and comfortable bed from here? No, Mikey, I'm fine with the bed at my place. Hmm, okay, then let's move on. Wow, how I dreamed about it. It's incredible. Is there finally going to be a washing machine in our camp? Mikey, this is incredible. This is the newest and very powerful gaming computer. Where did this gaming computer come from? It seems we have found the most useful thing in this dump. We have to take this cool gaming computer with us. Do you agree with me? Oh, yes, JJ. I agree with you. We have to take this gaming computer to our camp. Let's do it. Wait, I think I hear something. What? What are you talking about? Hey, guys, come here. We found a very useful thing for our camp. We really need your help to move this thing to our camp. Mikey, I don't like it. We have to tell them that we will bring this cool gaming computer to our camp. Yes, you're right, JJ. Nothing could be more useful than a cool gaming computer. Hey, girls, show us what you found. Oh, JJ, here. Look, this is a real washing machine. Cool, isn't it? We have to take this washing machine to our camp. This washing machine will be very useful. We need it. What? Seriously? A washing machine? Sorry, girls. Mikey and I have other plans. We want to take a cool gaming computer with us to the camp. This computer is much more useful than your washing machine. Okay, then starting tomorrow, it's the gaming computer that will cook your breakfast and wash your clothes. Agreed. JJ, don't worry. We can come back for this gaming computer another time. Oh, okay, girls. We will help you. Just don't stop making us delicious breakfast, okay? And we also suggest returning to this place a little later in order to take something else to the camp. JJ, it seems the girls didn't even listen to us. So what? Are you ready? I'm sure this washing machine is very heavy. Yes, Mikey, I'm ready. Let's move this washing machine to our camp soon. Boys, hurry up. We have to get back to camp before evening. It's very dangerous on this island in the evening. Oh, yes, I don't really want to meet evil wolves here in the evening. Mikey, this is terrible. I didn't know this washing machine was so heavy. It's getting harder for me every minute. Oh, yes, JJ, I agree with you. It seems to me that very soon I will run out of strength. You'll have to carry this washing machine alone. Oh, no. Boys, we're almost there. Hurry up. There are only a few hundred meters left to the camp. Let's run faster. Yes, JJ, Mikey, let's hurry up. You're slow as snails. Mikey, will you come up and help me carry this washing machine? It's not funny. It's very hard for me. JJ, I'm helping you. Don't you see that? I do the hardest work. I drag the washing machine alone. Oh, Mikey, this is a very funny joke. Phew, we finally did it. It was the hardest hike of my life. We dragged the washing machine to our camp for several hours. My back hurts a lot. 
Yes, we did it! JJ, Mikey, thank you very much. Today, I will wash all the things and all the clothes in our camp. Guys, I think I'm very tired, too. I'm going to rest at my place. See you tonight. TV, woman. Mikey and I are very glad that we helped you. Now, perhaps we'll leave you alone with your new washing machine. If you need any more help, call us. Okay, see you guys later. Well, Mikey, what are we going to do next? JJ, let's play catch up. You have to catch up with me. Let's. Oh, Mikey, it was too easy. Now it's your turn to catch up with me. Come on, you can do it. I believe in you, Mikey. Don't worry, JJ. I can easily catch up with you. It will only take me one minute. <coughs> Mikey, that's it. I give up. I suggest you stop playing. Stop! Did you hear that scream? It was the scream of a TV woman. Yes, it was the scream of a TV woman. But where is she? Hey, TV woman, where are you? It's us, Mikey and JJ. Hey, guys. Help me! I'm stuck in the washing machine! I do not know how to get out of here! Oh, Mikey! Wasn't it my imagination? Is the TV woman really stuck in the washing machine? We have to help her! Oh, yes, JJ! Of course we will help TV woman get out of this trap! TV woman, don't move! I'm coming to you! Mikey, what did you say? Be careful! Get me out of here! Let's get started! A new day has finally arrived! This means that today my best friend Mikey and I will start a new adventure. It's so cool. I'm so glad. By the way, interesting. Where is my friend Mikey now? Hi, JJ. You're finally awake. I've been waiting for this for so long. Hurry up and go outside. Our adventures begin right now. Stop. Mikey, what are you doing here? Did you spy on me while I was sleeping? Seriously? What? Of course not. I wouldn't do that. Ouch. Hey, Mikey, are you all right? Are you hurt? I can call a doctor. No, don't worry, JJ. I've already fallen off this trampoline 100 times. Oh, OK, Mikey. Wait for me. I'm on my way. I don't want to watch you fall again. So, hi, Mikey. Do you have any idea what we're going to do today? Look, this trampoline is so big. We can jump on it all day. Do you want me to show you a new trick I learned today? It looks just amazing. Oh, no, don't do that. It's very dangerous. Wow, this is TV Woman. She's so beautiful. Interesting. Where is she going? Oh, I don't know, Mikey, but you're definitely right. TV Woman is very beautiful. JJ, I have a very cool idea. Let's make a day of pranks over the TV Woman. I'm sure it will be a lot of fun and funny. I already have some ideas for pranks. Run after me. Hmm, Mikey, are you sure this is a good idea? TV Woman won't be offended by us? JJ, don't be afraid. Everything will be fine. It will be just harmless jokes. I am sure that TV Woman will not be offended by us. So, first I need to find one item. Okay, let's try to make a prank on TV Woman. Tell me, what item are you looking for and why do we need this item? I was looking for scissors. We will need these scissors for the final prank. Trust me, the final prank will really surprise you. But we'll talk about this prank a little later. And now, I need to go to the second floor and get another very interesting item there. Okay, Mikey, I'll wait for you here. Great, I found it. Now we are completely ready for pranks on TV women. Toilet, Mikey, are you serious? Why do we need a toilet? I don't understand anything. JJ, you forgot the most important fact. TV woman is a secret agent. She is constantly fighting with Skibidi toilets. Do you remember that? Yes, I remember that, but I still don't understand anything. Oh, JJ, I will climb into this toilet and I will look like a Skibidi toilet. Then we will call the TV woman to a meeting and scare her. Cool, isn't that right? You need to call TV woman and tell her that we will be waiting for her in an abandoned building of our village. Two hours later. Okay, JJ, wait for me. I'll be there soon. Guys, we did it. Please help us like this video and subscribe to the channel. Your support is very important to us. Then we will succeed. So Mikey, I just called TV woman. She said she was coming here soon. Great, JJ. Good job. She's coming here soon. Look, she's already here. Hurry up and hide. Oh, right, Mikey. Be careful. I'm sure everything will go great. Hey, JJ. Mikey, where are you? Can you hear me? Hmm, this is very strange. Great. The Skibidi Toilet of Mikey will appear right now. Hello, TV woman. I'm Skibidi Toilet Mikey. I want to eat your brains and turn you into another Skibidi Toilet. Come to me. Oh, no. How is this possible? Hmm, Mikey. It seems to me that we went a little too far. TV Woman was so scared that she fainted. Was this part of our plans? What should we do now? Hmm, you're right. 
I didn't think that TV woman would faint. But we have a plan B. This situation only accelerated our next prank. To begin with, we need to drag the TV woman to her home, and then I'll get my scissors. Mikey, tell me, what is the essence of the second prank? Why do we need scissors? Oh, JJ, it's very simple. We need these scissors to tear TV woman's clothes. This is an old popular prank. Have you forgotten about it? Look, ha ha. What? Mikey, why did you do that? And if the TV woman wakes up, she will destroy us. JJ, we'll be out of here before TV woman wakes up. Okay. What? Mikey? JJ? What are you doing at my house? Why am I without clothes? Oh, guys, you are very unlucky. Because when I find my pants, I will destroy you for this act. Oh, no. TV woman, forgive us. We didn't mean to hurt you. To be honest, this is Mikey's idea. I don't care whose idea it is. I will destroy you both. JJ, let's get out of here. Otherwise, we're finished. Well, JJ, it seems that despite the fact that it was my idea, TV woman will destroy us both. Mikey, it's all because of you. I didn't like this idea right away. Now, TV woman is definitely offended by us. But I agree. It was very funny. Oh, good morning. A new day has finally arrived. It was our first night on this desert island. Yesterday, we built a camp and went to bed. And today, our new adventures will begin. Hmm, it seems my friend Mikey and TV Woman are still sleeping. And I'm very hungry. I won't wake up my friends. I guess I'll just walk around our island and try to find some food. Yes, I'll do it. Guys, if you like our survival on the island, support us. Like this video and subscribe to the channel. Then tomorrow, a new episode of our survival on the island will be released. So, where's my food? I want to eat. Wow, take a look. It's a whole bush with berries. Great. There are so many berries here. Mikey and TV Woman will be very happy when they find out how many berries I found. Hmm, I have a very strange feeling. To be honest, it seems to me that someone is watching me. Hey, Mikey, TV Woman, is that you? This is not a very funny joke. I didn't see anyone, but I'm really sure that someone is watching me. This is very suspicious. I really hope that I won't find a problem on this island. Okay, I have an idea. I'll just pick some berries and go back to our camp. We need to hurry up. We don't know yet if there are dangerous animals on this island. I don't want to be attacked by a monkey. Hey, is anyone here? We can talk. My friends and I have a camp. Great, I was right. I'm not the only survivor on this island. We need to spy on this guy. Oh, right, I have a trap. Poor boy, he's going straight to my beast trap, but that's okay. As long as this guy is in my trap, I'll be safe. Oh, great. I'm almost at the camp. My food trip will make my friends very happy. I'm so glad I found the food. Wow, good morning. Did we really manage to survive the first night on the island? That's great. So what? What is our plan for today? Good morning, Mikey. JJ is in charge. You even call him captain. By the way, where's JJ? Have you seen him? Hmm, no. There's no JJ in the tent either. Where could he have gone? Mikey, what if JJ was kidnapped? What if JJ is in danger right now? We need to find and save him. Precisely. TV woman, you're right. Hurry up and run. We have to search the nearest area of this island. We will find our friend JJ and save him. Captain JJ, we're coming for you. Oh, what? Where am I? What happened? Oh, no. I think I fell into a hole. This is very bad. I need to get out of here before night falls. Hey, somebody, help me, save me, TV woman, Mikey. Well, hello, let's get acquainted. Stop, what? You don't look like a TV woman. You don't look like Mikey. Who are you and what are you doing here? I thought there was no one else on this island. My name is Camera Woman. I also flew on a plane that crashed and I also thought I was alone here, but it seems that the two of us made a mistake. Okay, nice to meet you. My name is JJ. Maybe you can help me get out of here. In return, I can give you some berries. Here you go. This will help you get out of this hole. You can keep the berries. I'm not hungry. By the way, you were talking about your friends. If I'm not mistaken, their names are TV, Woman, and Mikey. They got to this island too. Where are they? I used to work with TV Woman. I think she'll be glad to see me. 
You can come with me. I'll show you our camp. We can't be bothered by new people in our camp. I am sure that together we can get out of this island. JJ, this is a cool idea, but look at you. You're very dirty. We can't come to your camp like this. Follow me. I know one great place where we can swim and wash at the same time. And after that, we'll go straight to your camp. Okay? Hmm. Okay. This is really a great idea. I am very interested to find out what kind of place this is. Five minutes later. Here, look, this is a small body of water inside the island. The water is much cleaner here. That's why we can swim here. Don't be afraid. There are no sharks here. Everything will be fine. Wow, the water is very warm here. This is unexpected. It's like I'm taking a huge bath. I need to remember and show this place to my friends. Yes, we will definitely show this place to your friends. JJ, I'm so glad we met. I thought I was all alone on this island. But it's not like that. I have a strong man next to me now. Hurry up, let's kiss. Oh no, camera woman, what are you doing? Stop it, I'm begging you. We need to hurry up and go to my friends. The tracks lead directly to this pond. Stop, what? TV woman, do you see this? It seems JJ is kissing some pretty girl right now. Oh no, Mikey, it seems JJ has betrayed us. He left us for the camera woman. Stop! What? A camera woman? What is she doing here? JJ, you're a traitor. We thought that you had been kidnapped and we immediately went on a quest to save you. Are you just kissing and having fun here? Don't come to our camp anymore. Guys, no, wait, I went to look for food for us. You've got it all wrong. I didn't want to kiss anyone here. Wait a minute. Oh, JJ, forgive me for not holding back and kissing you. It seems that your friends are offended by you now. I didn't mean to quarrel with you. Camera woman, it was very nice to meet you, but I have to go. I have to make peace with my friends. Let's meet a little later at the same place, okay? Good, JJ, I'll be waiting for you at the same place. Good luck to you. I'm sorry again, thank you for this day. And thank you. Bye, guys, please help me like this video and subscribe to the channel so that my friends will forgive me. Let's get started. Today, my best friend Mikey and I are in search of new adventures. Look what we found on the street. It's a trampoline. Wow, Mikey, you jump so high. Oh yes, this trampoline is so cool. JJ, come here. We can jump on this trampoline together. How do you like this idea? Oh no, I can't jump. Hmm, Mikey, what did you see? Why are you hanging in the air? She is very beautiful. What? Mikey, get up quickly. Who are you talking about? Who is beautiful? JJ, you didn't see her? I'm talking about TV woman. I saw her and was speechless. She is very beautiful. Let's invite her to walk with us, please. Wow, you were right. TV woman is really very beautiful. Of course, Mikey, let's invite her to walk with us. Hey, TV woman, wait. I wanted to tell you that you look very beautiful today. Don't you want to take a walk with me and JJ? Oh, hi, Mikey. Hi, JJ. I'm sorry, but I'm very busy today. Let's go for a walk another day. And now I have to leave. Have a nice day, guys. Thanks, we can go for a walk tomorrow. How do you like this idea, TV woman? Oh, what a pity that she is busy today. I like to walk with TV woman so much. Interesting. What is she doing today? I don't know. Mm, JJ, I have a cool idea. Let's follow the TV woman and find out what she's doing today. We will become real spies. Mikey, and don't you think that the TV woman will be offended at us if she finds out that we will spy on her? I don't want her to be offended by us. Don't worry, JJ. We will act quietly and carefully. We need to think. JJ, don't be afraid. TV woman won't notice us. She won't even know we're spying on her. Aren't you interested in what a TV woman will do? What if she goes to battle with the Skibidi toilets? Hmm, you're right. It's very interesting. Okay, guys, please support us. If you want us to spy on the TV woman, then like this video and subscribe to the channel. This will help us a lot, and then TV woman will not know anything. Oh no, Mikey, we need to hide urgently. Where can we hide? Precisely, hiding in the bushes. She won't see us here for sure. You're right, Mikey. This is a great place. We have to be quiet. Hmm. Is it just me, or did I see someone in the window? There's no one here, okay? I must have imagined it. Mikey, did you hear that? We were almost noticed. Where do you think TV woman is going? JJ, 
Did you notice anything strange? TV woman changed into a bathing suit. Maybe she's going to the pool. To the pool? Why didn't she invite us to the pool? I don't know. Mikey, you were right. I can't believe my eyes. TV woman really came to the pool, but why couldn't she go there with us? Does she really not want to be friends with us anymore? It's very sad. JJ, we need to keep spying on TV woman. I'm sure it's not as easy as we think. Maybe TV woman has an important meeting in this pool. We'll find out soon enough. We need to get into the pool. Okay, you're right, Mikey. You can't jump to conclusions. Let's go inside. Hello, we came to the pool. What? Wait, do you know what a dress code is? How are you dressed? This is terrible. I won't let you into the pool in these clothes. First, you have to change into a bathing suit. Otherwise, you won't get inside. Oh, Mikey, we didn't think of that at all. Where can we get a bathing suit now? Do you have any ideas? Hmm, there is a clothing store in our village. I'm sure we can find a bathing suit there. But we need to hurry. We have very little time. We need to find out what the TV woman is doing in this pool. Mikey, this is a great idea. Hurry up and run. I'm sure we'll find some cool bathing suits. Oh, yes. I think so, too. It's going to be cool. Five minutes later. Oh, Mikey, I was wrong. These bathing suits are so funny. Are we really going to the pool in such bathing suits? Everyone will laugh at us. Hey, security guard, can we pass the dress code now? Take a look, we are dressed properly. Hmm, wait one second. Yes, I see. Now everything is correct. You can go inside. I wish you a pleasant stay. Good luck. Oh, finally. Thank you. We have been looking for these swimming suits for a very long time. Finally, we can go swimming. Wow, JJ, it's so cool here. Look, this is an amazing place. Why didn't TV Woman call us here? It's incredible! Look at how many people are here! All these people are resting! Hmm, I don't know, Mikey. But I agree with you. This place is really, really cool. What are we going to do next? Are we going to keep spying on TV Woman? Maybe we'll just rest. JJ, look! I see a TV Woman! No, we won't give up. I want to find out why TV Woman didn't invite us to come to such a wonderful place. We have to find out. That's why we'll keep spying on her. Mikey, don't you think we won't see anything else? TV Woman came here to relax. I am sure that now she will just swim and lie on the beach. That's it. Our spy game is over. But JJ, how do we find out why TV Woman did this to us? Let's just go up to her and ask. Maybe she had really good reasons. I'm sure she couldn't just leave us and rest without us. Okay. Ouch. Be careful. Let's go to the TV Woman and ask her what's going on. I have a lot of questions and I want to get answers to these questions. Come on. JJ. Oh, I really hope that TV woman won't take offense at us for spying on her. She's our best friend. I don't want to quarrel with her, but you're right. We need to understand what happened and why she left us. Don't worry, JJ. Now we will find out everything. Hey, TV woman, what are you doing here? We invited you for a walk and you said you were busy today. But in fact, you just went to relax in the pool without us. How do you explain this? Oh no, Mikey, JJ. What are you doing here? Were you spying on me? This is terrible. But even worse is that it is very dangerous here. You don't understand anything. I'm on a secret mission. Oh no, it's too late. Guys, be careful. There's going to be a very loud explosion. What? ski beady toilet? How is this possible? Is TV Woman really on a secret mission? JJ, Mikey, hide! What are you going to do? Oh, I think I got it. Wow. TV Woman, you saved everyone. You destroyed that stupid skibidi toilet. It's incredible. Now I understand why you left us. I'm sorry we spied on you. Oh, yes. It seems people are very happy that TV Woman destroyed the skibidi toilet. TV Woman, Mikey's right. Forgive us. We thought you didn't want to be friends with us anymore. Guys, what nonsense is this? We are friends and we will continue to be friends. But let's make a deal. Don't ever spy on me again. You shouldn't have come here. You have jeopardized my entire secret mission. In general, no more espionage. Mikey, we were wrong, but there is good news. Now this whole huge pool is at our disposal. All the people got scared and ran away. We can swim here as much as we want. JJ, it's so cool. Let's play hide and seek here. Go, 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 go. Hustle out, hustle every single day. I'll be making moves till I'm buried in my grave. 
Through the system, I don't wanna be a slave I've been doing shit my way